the Monty Hall problem. You are on a game show. The host of the game show reveals three doors. Behind one of the doors is a big bag of cash. Behind the other two doors is a single peanut. The host tells you to pick a door. Whichever door you choose, you will win the prize behind it. Okay, so let's choose a door. Hmm, let's go with door number one. At this point, the host, who knows which door contains which prize, will reveal a door containing a peanut from one of the two doors you did not pick. For the sake of illustration, the host at this point will reveal door number three. It's important to note that the host always opens a door to reveal a peanut. At this point he asks you, would you like to switch your door to door number two? Or would you like to stick with your original choice? And thus is the Monty Hall problem. The question of the problem is, probability wise, does switching your door increase your chance of winning the bag of cash? Or does it make no difference at all? What do you think? If you said it makes no difference, you're probably thinking that since there are two doors left, the chance of you winning the cash bag is 50-50, which sounds sensible, but is unfortunately wrong. In fact, switching your door will double your chance of winning every time. And there's many ways to explain it, but we will try to do it without too many scary numbers. To understand how switching doors doubles your chances of winning the bag of cash, let's see what happens when you don't switch. At the start of the game, you were asked to pick a door, remember? Since there are three doors and one hides a cash bag, your chance of picking the cash door is 1 out of 3, or 33.3333, an infinite 3% chance. So for the sake of time, let's just say 33%, okay? Conversely, since there are two doors that hides peanuts, you have a 2 out of 3, or about a 66% chance of picking a peanut door. Which means that if you don't swap, it doesn't matter which peanut door the host opens, your probability of winning the cash bag remains at 33%. Now let's see the consequences of switching. Okay, worst case scenario. Let's say by chance you pick the cash door. That means by switching, you will end up with a peanut door. But the chance of you doing this is still 33%, because it's only 33% that you will pick the cash door on their first go. But if you picked a peanut door, the host only has one other peanut door to open, which means that by switching, you will win the bag of cash. Essentially, every time you pick a peanut door, doesn't matter which one, the host will have to reveal the other peanut door, which means by switching, you will always win the bag of cash and the chance that you picked a peanut door the first time is 66% of the time. So by swapping, you have a 33% chance of winning a peanut and a 66% chance of winning the bag of cash. Therefore, you should always switch because switching gives you 66% chance of winning the bag of cash versus 33% chance of winning a peanut. So really, the crux of the Monty Hall problem is not whether or not you should switch, but rather, what would you rather win? The bag of cash or a peanut?